Hi, I'm Madhu Mizra, a pediatric endocrinologist at Massachusetts General Hospital, and I'm going to tell you how to collect a 24-hour urine sample for cortisol estimation. If you have to collect your urine for 24 hours for cortisol, here are the steps that you should follow. When you wake up in the morning, on the day of the collection, void or pee into the toilet to empty your bladder. The time that you empty your bladder into the toilet is the time that your 24-hour urine collection begins. For example, this could be 8 a.m. on Saturday morning. Please remember that the urine you pee at this time is not collected in the bottle. Write down the time and date on the bottle using a black marker or on a piece of paper that is taped to the bottle. Now you need to save all the urine that your body makes for the next 24 hours in this bottle. Every time you need to avoid or pee, you will need to save this in the bottle. You can use a plastic container, also called a hat, to make the process easier. Place the hat on the toilet and void into the hat. Pour all the urine in the hat into the bottle that you were given for the collection. Close the cap of the bottle and repeat this step each time that you need to pee so that every drop of your urine for 24 hours is collected in this bottle. Exactly 24 hours after the time that you started timing the collection, you need to empty your bladder one last time and save this last urine in the bottle. Write down the end time. If, you, if your start, start time was 8 a.m. on Saturday morning, your end time would be 8 a.m. on Sunday morning. Please remember that the last urine at 8 a.m. should go into the bottle and not the toilet. This finishes your 24-hour urine collection.